Hey, this is Stacy from Let's Cook Y'all. Welcome back to our channel. We are back with an update on our Caloric brand digital air fryer. We purchased it about six months ago and have really enjoyed it. However, we have had one problem with it that we wanted to update you guys on. And also what we did that didn't help and what we did that did help to fix the problem and also our experience with Caloric's customer service. So the problem we're having is with the basket. The problem we were having was when you would take it out and you'd start to lift the basket up, the basket would come loose from the pan and the pan would drop on the floor. Even if it was in the locked position. So what we noticed, there's a natural crack where they join these two pieces of plastic together to make the handle. And there's a locking mechanism that goes through there. There's three screws that hold this piece of plastic to the handle. Uh, two on the bottom, one that's just under here. Right here, you can see it behind the silver plate. Actually, you can't. Okay, there's a screw that you can see behind the silver bra bracket. Um, that screw is the main one that attaches this plastic piece to this plastic piece. There's two down here as well, but those are not the problem. The biggest problem is this screw here. And when Caloric built this basket, and it's the same as a lot of other brands, they put in small screws. And that screw, once it, the plastic gets hot, the more pliable it pulls out. So what I did to replace it. Well, the first thing we tried was super glue. Oh, well, yeah, we tried a, a few different types of glue and the heat doesn't work well with glue. So it would, as soon as you brought it out with something You can something see a little residue it, from where we tried. And you had something heavy in the basket and you did a little shaking. Uh, like you're supposed to shake like the food. Like you're supposed to, it would break and come loose again. So our way of fixing it was to replace those screws. Now I'll show you where the screws are. First, unscrew the three silver screws that are holding the main silver bracket from the inside of the basket. Tim used a crescent wrench to hold these nuts on the outside of the basket in place to help get the screws off, a little screwdriver on the inside, and he held them in place with the crescent wrench on the outside. I replaced these four screw or these three screws. They were smaller screws, real similar to these. And I replaced them with much larger screws. Larger or longer? Longer and larger. Larger and longer. So they would hold. But the main one is this one. But the main one is this one at the top. So you have to take that bracket off to get to these. Right. Okay. So ours has already been done, but that's I'll show you the screw that I put in the top one. A much bigger screw. This is what came out of it? Something real similar to that, real small. This one is the one that came out of it, or real similar to that size, and he put in a much longer, larger screw. So I'm putting this back together. It does not go like this. It goes like this. <laughs> we, we did it wrong the first time. Oh, no, off. we didn't do it wrong. We, we tried to do we it wrong. We tried to do it wrong. It, it doesn't work. fit. It doesn't fit on the back side. It goes on the inside. And there's three screws. The two longer ones, are, it's hard to see the different sizes. But there's two that seems to be a little longer and they go in the top. And then the nuts go on the bottom. So that was our solution for fixing the basket that would fall out no matter whether it was locked in the locked position or not. I did contact Caloric. <laughs> I did contact Caloric customer service 
about four months in when this happened and they very kindly answered me back and pointed me to the warranty which i did not read the fine print just like i don't read the fine print when i download an app to my phone i just hit i agree but apparently in the warranty it states that they do have a one-year warranty i asked to have another basket sent to us and they informed me that the warranty impl uh, implicitly stated that it was the customer's responsibility to pay for the unit to be shipped back for them the that whole unit right the whole unit to be shipped back to them then they would test it in their lab if they deemed if it was something it was covered under the warranty they would ship us a replacement if not and we wanted our unit back we would also have to pay to have it shipped back to us so since this unit is a little heavy even though this is the 3.2 quart and not the larger five point something we decided our money was better spent on doing a fix and we will pursue another air fryer at some point the fix right now has been in probably about six weeks and it has not the longer screw seems to be holding so it is working but that's something to be aware of with these basket style air fryers and also in particular caloric and their customer service policy we want just wanted to share an update hope this helps someone as always thanks so much for stopping by our channel let's cook y'all hope you'll like comment and subscribe if you hadn't already have a wonderful and blessed day y'all see you in the next one